and today we are going to learn how to solve two-step equations. Um, we're solving two-step equations. There is a goal, which is to get x by itself, or the variable, and a reminder, which is to always do the same thing to both sides of the equation. When you look at an equation like this, you'll see that there's an equal sign. And there's things on the left side of the equal sign and things on the right side. And whenever we're solving two-step equations, we want to make sure that we do the same thing to the left side as to the right side. There are going to be four steps in solving two-step equations. They are identify the variable, add or subtract, multiply or divide, and plug in. So now I'm going to do a short example for you all that you're going to help me through. So this equation says 3x plus 7 equals 16. If we look at our steps, the first step is to identify the variable. The variable is a letter um, that looks different because all the other things in the equation will be numbers. Can anyone see um, what might be the variable in this equation? Let's go with Becca. X. Yes, the variable is X. So we have now done step one. We have identified the variable. Um, if we look back at our goal, it is to get X by itself. So now we need to do step two to help us do that. Step two is add or subtract. When we look at the left side of the equation, we see that x is not by itself because there's a three and a seven. And the first thing we need to do is get rid of the seven by adding or subtracting. So we need to think about what can we subtract from seven to get zero so that it goes away completely. Really, do you have an idea? Seven. Yes, if we subtract seven from seven, we get zero. However, we have to keep in mind our reminder, which is to always do the same thing to both sides of the equation. So we're going to subtract 7 here to get 0, but we have to make sure we also subtract 7 from the right side of the equation, too. Um, so we're going to carry out this step, and when we do this, the 7s turn into a 0, so they cancel, and on the left side, we have 9. So now we are left with 3x equals 9. We move on to step 3, which says multiply or divide. If we look back at our goal, which is to get x by itself, we're now looking at the left side of the equation, and we almost have x by itself, but there's still a 3 next to it. So we need to think, what can we multiply or divide by to get rid of the 3? Or how can we turn the 3 into a 1, so that instead of saying 3x, it just says x? So, um, Dana, can you think of what we might divide 3 by to get 1? 3. Yes, we can divide by 3. So now we're going to divide both sides of the equation by 3, keeping in mind our reminder to always do the same thing to both sides of the equation. And on the left side, we get 1, or 1x. One and on the right side, we have 9 divided by 3, which is 3. Now that we have solved for x, we are looking at our fourth step, which is to plug in for x. Um, so we look back at our original equation. It says 3x plus 7 equals 16. Uh, Mariah, what are we going to plug in for x? 3. Yes, because that is what we got for x. So now we have 3 times 3 instead of x plus 7. And when we do this out, we get 3 times 3 is 9 plus 7 is 16. And since this 16 matches this 16, we know that we have done the solving the equation correctly. So now it is your turn to try this out. If you could all look at the worksheet that I've handed you and work on it with your partner. Um, you can solve the equation together, and when you're all done, make sure you plug in and check to see if you got the answer correct. All right, now we're going to share our answers. So this group over here, what did you get for x? Um, we got 3. And what did you guys get? We also got x equals 3. Great, that must be the correct answer. So now we're going to learn a song to help us remember this method for solving two-step equations. I will demonstrate the song once, and then you guys can all join in. So the song goes like this. It goes, find x, find x, add or subtract, multiply or divide. Find x, find x, add or subtract, multiply or divide. Plug it in, plug it in. That's how we see if we got it right. Plug it in, plug it in. That's how we see if we got it right. All right, can everyone try to sing along this time? Okay, so find x, find x. Add or subtract, multiply or divide. Find x, find x. Add or subtract, multiply or divide. Plug it in, plug it in. That's how we see if we got it right. Plug it in, plug it in. That's how we see if we got it right. Awesome job! Yay!